Hi guys, I'm Phil Snow, Neve, Battle of Summer Performance Coach. Kabow, kabow, kabow. So today then uh, is a video following on from our uh, recent videos on habits. Again, okay? today's video is all about implementing habits and starting a new habit. Four principles here that you can see. The first one being make it obvious. Okay, let's talk about nutrition. So, uh, say you have a bad habit and you've got sweets in the drawer. Well, obvious thing to do is get rid of those sweets. Okay, and possibly replace it with some fruit instead. Kapow! Who would have thought it? Next thing we need to do is make it attractive, okay? So if we're thinking about uh, types of exercise, for instance, right? Um, if I was to say, right, okay, you need to go for a 16 mile run, something ridiculous like that, and you hate running well, obviously that's not gonna be attractive, is it? But if you like doing weights, and I said, right, okay, go and do squats until your eyes bleed, then you will be more likely to do the squats over the 16 mile run, okay? So make sure you're picking the right exercise for yourself. Easy, make it easy for yourself, okay? So if there's a choice between the gym that's two miles away or 10 miles away, just because it's sexier at the 10 mile away gym and possibly a little bit cheaper, well, the two mile gym you're probably more likely to go to because it's closer, it's more convenient. There's no need to make it any harder for yourself. As well, uh, if we're talking about nutrition, uh, I'll give you an example of myself. I get this, exactly the same food every day from the, the same salad, the same salad bowl from the same supermarket, but hopefully from the same guy as like he gives me bigger portion sizes. But uh, I eat exactly the same thing. I take the stress and the effort out of thinking what I have to eat. Okay, I just go in there. He says hello, and he. he pretty much does it for me anyway, without me having to say what it is, okay? So make your food shops uh, options nice and easy. Lastly, then you gotta make the, the, the habit satisfying. Generally speaking, if you've just been for a workout that you didn't wanna really go to, you're gonna feel a little bit better about yourself anyway, with, with any type of exercise. But you need to make like the food choices more satisfying, okay? Think about the taste buds, whether it's sweet, sour, bitter, um, whether it's uh, 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 sweet or savory, for instance, okay? Making sure that fits in with your dietary requirements and your dietary goals to help you reduce body fat if that is your set goal. Now it's all well and good kind of going through these principles here, but it is important that you do remember to put the effort in, okay? Just gonna give you this simple equation, all right? If we had 100, okay? If I added 50% of my effort to that, that would give me 150 there. But if I was to reduce my effort by 33%, just 33%, okay, that would take me back down to 100 again, okay? Just by reducing my effort by 33%, okay? Go and do the math on that. So guys, you have to keep at it, okay? Repeat uh, your habits, build them like houses. I've, I've talked about this before. Habit after habit after habit. You have to keep repeating them to get much better at them, okay? Guys, I hope that's helped out. Keep it real. <laughs>